Well, it's a hi from Biker's Nod, and we're just wondering whether or not you fancy a funked up subspecies of the Himalayan. If so, then here you have it. The Royal Enfield Himalayan Scram 411. Coming from the Royal Enfield Stable, renowned for its superbly crafted Himalayan, and of course the Continental GT650, we might have expected the brand to poke its nose eventually into the ADV crossover market, a trend that in fact has been with us for over half a century. Now the retro styling, spoked wheels, dual purpose knobbly tyres, that upswept exhaust and single cylinder motor kind of give the game away here, but most of all it's fun to ride. It's got the same 411cc air-cooled single four-stroke motor as used in the Himalayan, producing 24.3 HP and 32 newton meters of torque, plus it's got a five-speed gearbox. It's a comfortable, capable machine, and with a price tag of just £4,599, yep, you heard that correct, it won't make you wince when you count out the old banknotes. As for the riding position, the seat height at 795mm is 5mm less than the Himalayan, meaning that the bars are slightly higher and offer a more upright, comfortable stance. We found that the Scram is solid, reliable, characterful, built to a budget, and the tank will give you a good run for your money, fuel-wise. It's not the fastest bike on the market, of course not, and we don't expect it to be quick, but it isn't. And don't expect to be able to hammer it along the motorway, because despite its top speed purportedly to be around 80 miles an hour, we didn't push it to its limit. It felt perfectly at ease at 60. Approaching 70 in the mirrors became a slight blur, and when I particularly wanted to make faster progress, the bike seemed, well, a little bit pissed off that I was pushing it so hard. But all in all, Royal Enfield took the plunge and have delivered on its mission to bring to the world market an ADV crossover bike of such merit at such a great price that we can't fault it. So go and try one. Have fun out there and stay safe.